St. Jerome's Croatian Church was founded in 1912 by Father Leon Medic on 25th Street near Wentworth Avenue in Bridgeport. Father Medic was one of those, uh, one of those Franciscans who came to this country in the beginning of the century, came to Chicago, didn't know nobody, didn't speak any English, uh, founded a parish in the middle, in the heart of Chicago, in a very interesting neighborhood in Chicago. A lot of the old documents say Yerolim, and that's because uh, that was the name of St. Jerome in the Dalmatian dialect of Croatian. And uh, St. Jerome was a saint who uh, lived during the time of the Roman Empire. The Croatians came to this region after Jer St. Jerome lived and died, but uh, they uh, always took uh, uh, him to heart as their person because he was a Dalmatian. They used him as the, as the namesake for the parish. Originally, the immigrants that settled in Bridgeport, the Croatian immigrants, came from the Dalmatian region of Croatia, which is the coastal region. And uh, that region has a very large shrine, a shrine to Our Lady of Seen, which is the icon that you'll see carried today in the procession. So when the people settled in the city of Chicago here, they immediately uh, brought this picture picture of Our Lady. My mother's at six years old, I'm 83 now. I marked when it was six when I was six years old when I first started here, my father. I'm doing that my 16 years, every year, all night, and I enjoy it. That's one day for my church from me. We got about all together about 80 pieces of lamb. We start yesterday around 3 p.m., put everything, put salt on, put lambs on stick, and start cooking. This is clearly what makes the city of Chicago what it is, uh, with over 600 events of this kind and this nature, ethnic neighborhood festivals. Whether you're from this neighborhood or not, these are what people love to come to about the city of Chicago. This is what people love, the food, the music, the people. I think this is the, the part that teaches us that it's important to recognize your roots, and this is a place where you keep your language, you keep your uh, culture alive. <laughs> 